a protest, a uh, peaceful protest against the uh, continuous bombing uh, of uh, Libya by the United States and NATO forces. We say that uh, the United States as well as NATO should respect the resolution passed by the African Union which called for non-foreign military intervention in the affairs, internal affairs of Libya. We also want to point out the foreign policy contradiction of the United States government that says that it's against uh, various dictators when at the same time you have a situation in Bahrain where Saudi Arabian troops were sent there to quell the people's uprising there and the United States is in continual support of Saudi Arabia, uh, the president of Yemen, as well as the other monarchies in the, that particular region. So we say that again and again that they are to respect the territorial integrity as proposed by the African Union, which consists of 53 countries. We also say that since the uh, International Criminal Court is investigating uh, the leader of uh, Libya, Muammar Gaddafi, for war crimes, we say it should do likewise for the George Bush administration which went to war in Iraq based on known lies where hundreds of thousands of sub Iraqi civilians as well as U.S. soldiers were killed or wounded in that particular war. What are your hopes? Well, our hopes is that, uh, again, stopping of the bombing that's taking place there and allowing the African Union to resolve the conflict that's taking place in Africa, in the country of Libya.